to Norris. Norris to Stutzla. Oh! Yes! Matthew Joseph! I just called it. I knew he was going to do something. He has been the MVP round one. Oh, Seth Jarvis finally. Come on, Talbot. And the Senators lift like that. Just like that. What a game. The pitch shock was everywhere. Oh, what a save by Vanishek. Stutzla. A game. Tim Stutzla in overtime has game, and the Senators are alive for another day. They tie the series. It's 2 2 to Byron. Oh, and he loses it. Oh my god, and Brad is gone. Brad is gone, and he wins it for the New Jersey Devils, and they tie the series. Oh, they shut the door in game seven. Ladies and gentlemen, we are back. The Ottawa Senators are finished playing through year one. We still have an off season. We still have the final four and the finals to get through. But what a year it was. Not much to complain about. Made it to game seven of round two. Uh, I'm looking at the wrong things here. But we held up pretty good. Just kind of lost the last game. Couldn't finish out game six. Couldn't finish out game seven. We scored perfectly in the playoffs. Our defense and our goaltending kind of a little high. Power play not the greatest either. Penalty kill not too bad. But we're going to have a busy offseason, I'm guessing. Not busy, but we're going to have some movement. Stutzloaf and Unreal playoffs. Pinto, good playoffs. Batherson, good playoffs. Norris, Debrinkit. Mate was a plus 10. Holy man. So Mate and Pinto, I think, just got jobs. But yeah, we're going to have to see. The Brinkat's getting signed. I've just been thinking, what, who are we going to We're going to have to move maybe a forward out. And I'm not too sure who. I really have no idea who. So, we'll look at the final four. We have done the playoffs first. So it's Edmonton, St. Louis, Boston, and New Jersey. I would like to say we're going to see an Edmonton and Boston final. So we'll check out Boston's lineup. Hall, Marchand. Marchand playing center with Pasternak. Kreishi, Bergeron, DeBrus, Felino, Zaka. So same old, same old Boston. Ooh. Excuse me. Omar with the 88. Omar's 88. Joe so Turton's on Boston. That's pretty sweet. OG. They are up against the New Jersey Devils. We know what they're all about, so we don't really need to check them out. Edmonton Oilers, Dry Saddle, McDavid Hyman, Pool My Pool My Harvey, R and N H Fogel. Looking not bad. Sam Oilers. Jack Campbell. Up against the St. Louis Blues. Haven't seen St. Louis make any trades or anything all season. Eighty four overall. Bennington, Thomas, Tarasenko. Not pretty deep, though. Uh, I like. I could see St. Louis. I could see another St. Louis Boston final. I don't know. Like New Jersey, though, too. Hmm. So we'll just move on ahead. Two one for Edmonton. Two two. 3-1 for Boston. So, yeah, Boston did. It looks like they're going to make the finals. Uh oh Yeah, Boston. Are we going to rematch? Oh, Edmonton's not having it. We're going to get Boston and Edmonton. Boston and Edmonton. Oh, yeah. Boston versus Edmonton in the Stanley Cup finals. Wow. Yeah. one nothing for Boston. Couldn't see the score of that game. 1-1, one, 3-2 one, for Edmonton. Woohoo. 2-1. Ah, oh, the square didn't come up. 2-1 for Edmonton. Big game four. Oh, a 3-1 win and a 3-1 series lead for the Oilers. They're one win. The Oilers are one win away from bringing the cup home. Uh-oh. Oh, Bruins aren't having it, though. Bruins aren't having it. Oh, Bruins aren't having it. Oh, my God. Game seven. And the Bruins take it. Ah, Edmonton. Ah, can't complain. We're, it's our duty. We're bringing the cup home. Edmonton, Boston, Edmonton chokes. Boston takes it home. 
with the year Boston's had in real life, you can see it. Presidents goes to Carolina. Edmonton makes the finals. Wow. And another Canadian team chokes in the finals. Art Ross goes to Matthews. Hart goes to Matthews. James Norris to Quinn Hughes. Lady Bank to Kucherov. Slavkowski ends up with the, with the Calder. I don't know. The Kuzmenko must have not been el- eligible. Con Smythe goes to Bergeron. Vezina goes to Bobrovsky. M. Jennings goes to Olmark. Ken Nishijuvov for the Bill Masterton. Jack Adams goes to the St. Louis Esh. Barkov to Frank J. Selke. Ted Lindsay to Matthews. And Rashar goes to McKinnon. So congratulations to the Boston Bruins. We'll check out how their team did. We'll see how Bergeron did at least. <coughs> oh, excuse me again. 20 points in 20 games. Nothing special, but look at their analytics stats. are plus 16, plus 14, plus 12. Felino. Oh, everybody on their team looked like they did something. No one had less than eight points for their forwards. Same with the defense. Just all productivity. And then I'm guessing their goalie did pretty solid too. Yeah, Omar. You could have given it to Omar. 16-3 and 1 in the playoffs. Holy man. Holy K. So... We are now in the off season, so we, we sim up the draft. We could probably sim up to here. We don't have a pick. You, I would reveal it or something if uh, we had a pick in here, but we don't. So nothing special. 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 6 to 7, Minnesota, 5 to 6, Arizona, Buffalo, Anaheim, and Los Angeles, and the Islanders all move down, and Columbus ends up getting the number one. Okay, so Columbus ends up with the uh, Connor Bernard. We'll check out the draft class franchise. Yeah. See how the draft goes. Review of retired players. All auto, auto scouting. So Thornton does retire. He got the Stanley Cup. No way. That's good for him. Stall Weber. What a what a textbook ending ending for a story for that is for Joe Thornton. So he would lead in games played and points and everything by far. Eric Stahl. Goalies, no goalies. So just Joe Thornton's class. Joe Thornton, Eric Stahl. Stahl is now coach. Joe Thornton's a, a scout. Blah, blah, blah. Draft interviews, you don't need to do those. And now we are here. We're at the NHL entry draft. So first thing... Kind of want to just check out my contract situation. Uh, for next year. No, no. So that's the thing. We got a lot of guys. Hmm. The one that kind of sticks out is Matthew Joseph. This is kind of a high cap hit. Batherson. We're not training Drew, obviously. And we have no defense inside. Yeah, this is going to be an interesting offseason. So I think we're just going to jump in. I don't know if we're going to... I don't think I'm going to trade a forward. That's the one. The one that sticks out the most is Joseph. He could... Rep- Leak some cap, but I don't know if I want to trade him yet. That was the one player on the fourth line that was kind of effective for us. So we're going to start the draft. Sim options. Uh, we'll just see. Pick number one should be Connor Bedard. Franchise, 80 overall. Columbus, him and Goudreau and Line. That should be pretty deadly. Um, so we'll actually let's just see. Fine trade. Um, that's the thing. We're all going to get a lot of relief. We have 10 million already. Byron's going to be up. Hamannick. Susie Zoo. Yeah. Watson. Uh, yeah, you know what? I think we're going to be fine. I think we're going to be good. So we're actually going to sim up. We're just going to... What's our action? Uh, we'll just sim up for round one. Sim to pick for round one. Ooh, there was 76 top six right before. Right in front, Climber. That would have been nice. Okay, so. Ooh, not much to pick from here. Elite. Ooh, there's a top six right here. Top six, left wing, sniper. 
eight plus league four goals plus fourteen. Two years. That looks pretty good. Actually, that looks pretty good. That looks pretty good. That looks pretty good. Hey, hey, got a trophy. Hey, he's got an X factor. Sixty-seven overall. That's okay. I'll take that sniper. Uh. Okay, so actually now, how many draft picks do we have? Second, we don't have a third. We don't have a third. We don't have a third. <clears throat> we aren't going to be able to get everything, anything up to get a third. That's the thing. Yeah, and there's nothing. The only one that really sticks out to me is Joseph. He signed for four years, too. Like, what the hell? A fifth, a fifth, a fifth, a fifth, a fifth, a fifth, a fifth. So you can't even really get a third for him. I'll hang on to him for now. Let's go to round two. A second for a third and a fourth. It should be good. We'll pick we'll take the second. HL, HL. <clears throat> Maybe a D-man top four. Bottom six for sure. Ooh, another top six. Is there a center playmaker now? So this guy would go good with the sniper, to be honest. C minus. Only 32 points, minus 10 in the C minus league, the USA Central. Five years, Joe Thornton. Even though he's only 173 pounds, Spinorama. He is a top six, though. He is only a top six around, too. You know what? I like him just because he fits with the sniper, too. So we're going to do this Theodata and that sniper. So we've got a bit of chem offensive chemistry going there. We should be getting a demon, though. We, were, we we already have a lot of young forwards, though, to be honest. So now we just skipped round three. We are in round four now. Ooh. 156. We're at pick 117. We could pick that elite. Left wing. And now there's a two-way forward. Top six. Chuck Cunningham. Five years. What about that D-man up here? That's elite. Low A+. Plus. Five years. You know what? We'll let's take this cutting out for now. Where do you go? Chuck Cunningham. Getting some young American forwards. We'll see if that D-man's still there. He might be. He is too. We'll just pick him up. Elite low. Whoa, 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 whoa. Cancel. Sim options. Sim to pick 181. The Senators will select. Who's else there? Some bottom six. I could get a bottom six guy. I could use a right winger. Uh, French starter goalie. Two way forward. Got power forward. Five years. Five years. Five years. Five years. You know, I'll just take this guy two way forward. <laughs> kind of just an ah, uh, whatever pick. Bottom six. If he develops, he does. If he can play in the AHL. And from final round, round seven. Two elites. Ah, uh, top four. Not much, just that bottom six. We could probably could upgrade our scouting. Scouting wasn't that great. Not any gems down here for sure. Um, should we just go off the board? Should we get that fringe starter maybe? Yeah, I would just be safe and take this fringe starter. Definitely got an American vibe with the players we just drafted. So that should be all. Same entire draft. The entry draft is now complete. One, two, three, four, five, six players added to the franchise. 
a goalie, a defenseman, four forwards. I think that sounds right. Um, so let's them up the resign phase. Okay, so we need to give up our coaches. So I like the coach we had. We definitely like it. He's gonna take up all the budget though. Uh Is that what he wants? Yeah, that moves, so we have to offer it to him. So there you go. That just took up everything, though. Um. Yeah, because now we're not going to be able to sign that guy. This guy. NHL assistant coach. Yeah, he can be resigned. He might have to be, this generalist might have to come to be an associate coach. Associate coach. So, we'll go to contracts. The most fun part, Talbot. So, Forsberg actually went up to an 84. Talbot does not want an extension. Two years at 2.5. So, that's the thing. We can't negotiate with them. We're Canadian dollars. That's what he wants. So, Bobo. Uh, 29. We don't need Bobo. He can, we can release him. Too many goalies here. Backup, Mandosale. Mandolisi. He wouldn't be much. Yeah, we can just sign you for one year, I guess. When we wait for DeVries. Defenseman. So Branchstrom needs a contract. He wants a con he definitely wants to get paid. Susie's gonna want a contract. Zub's gonna want a contract. Holden's going to want a contract. Bernard Docker's going to want a contract. Oh, my God. Qualify. So we're going to have to qualify these guys already. Usually, you have to, like, yeah, these guys, we're done the rebuild. We're qualifying our RFAs for cap space. Uh, so we are going to have one, two, three. That's four defensemen. Hamannick. Oh, he would want term and everything. Uh Get rid of this guy. He is all top two high, 25 years old. Uh, yeah, whatever, two years. Larson. Yeah, I'll give you one year. We might be short on deep end this year. This Thompson guy's coming up too, though. Yeah. Thompson. We might have to give him a shot. Uh, top six, 24. This guy's... Uh, Not really needed, to be honest. This guy's more needed. Come on, we want to give him more years, though. We give him three years. Romeo. Why not? Yeah, we'll just release this guy. 24. Nordberg. <laughs> You can stay, he's only 62, so yeah, you can stay unsigned for now. So then, yeah, we kind of got a situation here with the defensemen. Right wingers, so yeah, Debrinkat, he doesn't even want an extension. We can qualify him. Qualify RFA, but that's so much money already that we've qualified. Debrinkat, Branchdome, and JBD. Yeah, we might have to trade Joseph. JC Hollowock. Nah, see, you can get you can get out. Watson, you're gonna have to release him. Sokolov looks like Mark, <laughs> looks like Mark Stone. <laughs> see, we'll give him a bit more too at nine fifty. Igor, Scott Sabarin, probably just let him go. Bottom six forward here. Kind of short on right wingers, and we just drafted a bunch of left wingers. So for Menton, uh, two years at two point five seven five. Paul Byron, ah, uh, Byron's gonna have to go. Tyler Mate. I liked how Mate played. I don't want to just let him go. 
centers. We'll just come back there. Shane Pinto. He doesn't want a bad deal. Could probably get away with that. Let's do that. Derek Broussard. Once over a mill. So we're reinventing our fourth line here. Gambrell, he's going to have to go. We won't even qualify him. Two years, 800. Release. Release. Top nine low, we can sign him. Okay. So that just leaves Forment and Mate. 21 mil in cap space. Because I'm even thinking, do I even really want Formentin? He didn't have the best chemistry. We could probably find, like, this is probably the one guy we could probably replace, I think, to be honest. Plus four. Um, I would like to keep Mate, though. I really do want to keep Tyler Mate. Um, one year, 1.425. We might just shut up and take it. We'll just shut up and take it. Right wingers, yeah. And then like odd defensemen, which should be good. Nick Holden, one two years. He wants two years though. Hamannick wants three years, which is kind of a bit out for me. The thing we're in Canada, I can't negotiate with them. I can negotiate with the younger guys, but not these guys. Zub. <laughs> so, see, so I'm. Uh, Susie's not bad, though. Three years at 2.2. .2, that's actually probably the best bang for your buck. Zub. Carson Susie's getting resigned. Bang. So, we'll, redu we'll do Susie. We're definitely still going to have over 15 mil. We should be able to get to Brinkat. Uh, branched him. Formington's gonna have to get qualified. We're gonna have to advance the day. So the coach accepted, that's good. That coach accepted, that's good. Mate accepted, 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 and all accepted, okay. We'll even go one more day. So let's check out the coaching staff now. 6.6. .6. So yeah, this coach hands again signed. Oh. 1.1. Well, if we, yeah, if we, if we're under the budget still. Get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. <laughs> we're going to have the same coaching staff too. We should be good for the coaches. Um. Contracts, so how much cap space? 18 mil. These guys do not have contracts. Zub. To bring cat. Can I, I, I don't think you can make trades right now, can you? No. This video has been going. Um, just trying to think. I have. I. I don't want to. Holden. Yeah, we can let him go to free agency. How many? We probably can let him go. Zub. Should I just resign Zub? Should I just resign Zub? Should I just resign Zub? Uh, defense. So we'll have one, two. We're gonna get branched them. That's four, so we will have a top four. We saw uh, Bernard Darker, and then we can just get another cheap guy. Yeah, I don't know. We don't need Zub. We don't need Zub. We don't need Zub. We don't need Holden. We don't need Hamnick. We're reinventing our defense. Right wingers, and now we just got our. You are they're just all RFAs now. Oh, I forgot about the goalie too. Shit. Uh, Talbot. 
you know what? Talbot was great for us, but he was almost a difference maker. If we would have had a bit better goaltending, game six, game six, seven, that one overtime, we probably could have won the series. He doesn't really want to. Uh, two years, two point five. Forsberg's ready to take the line. Stogard's ready to back up. We could probably just let Talbot go. We could probably just let Talbot go. Forsberg's net next year. Forsberg's net next year. Okay, so there we go, boys. Ah, so Bolton accepts. <laughs> there we go. We got all of our coaches back. I like to see that. We are at the free agency. We have 18 million in cap space. He's an RFA though. The Brink has an RFA asking for 7 million. So we might just get a huge offer for him. Uh, yeah, we might as well just wait out and see what happens. I don't want to go crazy. Who else is, was available? For UFAs. Pax already. O'Reilly, Pavelski, kind of some older guys, Tyler Bertuzzi, Kuzmenko, Bunting, Connor Brown, Taves, Kessel, Monaghan, not bad, kind of the same old, Klingberg, Ghost, Dumba, any goalies, At Freddie Anderson, Tristan Zar Jari, it's not bad, so, I, I bet you he's going to get qualified here in a quick week or two. You would think. Because all I want is for their value to drop, kind of. And then we're going to have to try, sign some cheaper players for our fourth and our bottom pairings. So a third and fourth for third and Benning. We'll decline that trade. We'll decline this trade. No offers. I'm waiting for an RFA offer. I didn't sign him. What the fuck? What the fuck? What a glitch. No way. So what did he just get signed to? One year for 6.4. <laughs> I didn't sign that fucking contract. What the hell, EA? Why is it, why is it randomly do that? Ah, that's gay. That sucks, to be honest. Uh... He was cheap though. <laughs> uh, so now we got Branstrom. Yeah, now these guys are gonna be less than these guys are less than six mil here. So we can probably just get this done right now. Branstrom, he just wants one year. The boys are taking discounts to sh to prepare a team for the future. I like it. I like it. They should all accept. Very good, very good. So now, check out our lineup. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. So, like we did, we lost our fourth line. We don't really have a fourth line center. Mate, I guess, could be a fourth line center. Uh, unless that's Solikov. So we can see if we can find some fourth line players here. Defensemen. One, two, three, four, five, six. That Thompson. So maybe just like one defenseman. Should be good. And then Sogard, Forsberg. I think we should almost be good there. Draft picks one, two. Two seconds, no third, and no seventh. I'll take that though. And we got 10 mil in cap space, so it's not bad. So, ah, fucking wrong button. So we still got actually got time, so we can just go to free agency right now. Guys, I did some pre scouting. Five guys were going to sign very minor, very, very, very minor signings for the Ottawa Senators here. Not much available. Jujuha Carrera, bottom six grinder. Could fight for a spot for a fourth line. Bang.
Um, where do you go? I didn't see him before. Oh, there he is. AJ Greer, power forward. Could probably compete for a bottom six penalty killing role. Like Derek started last year, so sign him. Bang. Right wingers, there was really nothing. Kind of just throw in Dennis Mulligan. A little more skill. Bang. And the two D-men. I was thinking about Dermot, but he's an RFA. And it was three, and it had to be for three years, so I wasn't eh. Kind of eh. Kind of eh on it. Nathan Bayou. Maybe just chuck him in there, top four, maybe a seventh guy. And then same with Lawrence Pilot, just to kind of plug up the system. Which I'm okay with, because we just lost so many D. And then goalies. Uh, do I need another goalie? Do you need another goalie? Let me just see. I know we lost two. We also drafted one. Wow, we have two fringe starter and a backup. Ah, we should be good. I think we're good. I think we're good. We have a 73 we can bring up. Ah. Uh, I don't want to go to next season. Oh, Kajuju. That was like really like the one guy I wanted. Uh, Jesus, no, no, no. Ah, uh, Juju. Is there another center? It's top six. Top six. Forward line three. I want forward line four. My coach just doesn't work with forward line four. Like, no one gets with him. Line three. Jamil Smith. Bottom six, two way. Mm. All penalty killing lines. Uh, should I just browse the trading block? Looking for a fourth line center. There are people on here. Forward line three. Lars Eller. No. No. Donato. Top six. No. No. Martinuk. Line three. I'm really kind of looking for line four, though. I'm really curious to see. I don't think I, like, can't even find a line four. <laughs> What's this? Uh, Byron. Paul Byron was the only one. Sunkfist. Top six. Just nothing. Oh, keep a she word. Sure would. She signed for one point four. <laughs> we could just make a trade. Uh Um, top six, sixty four. 
Um, just thinking, just thinking, just thinking. Uh, this guy. They would want more than that, though. I mean, we have to give up a draft pick. I don't really want to give up a draft pick. They want this goalie, too. For sure would. Could give them a fourth line opportunity. Yeah. Hmm. Now we're going to be giving up too much. Uh, <laughs> too much for Sherwood. Um, let's keep going. I don't know. He's probably going to be the only option, though. Juju. <laughs> they want to trade him already. They already want to trade him. We can get him for nothing. That's what it says. Hey, it still says he wants to play on our team. Bottom six. You know what? Because they want to trade him. Like that's so stupid. Like they just got him. Should I scam it? Like should I just scam it and get him? I think I kind of should. <coughs> I don't think it would hurt me. Uh, straight up like that. Yeah, like if it's that easy too, ah, screw him. He should just sign here in the first place. So we got Juju. Is there, I just want to keep seeing if there's any other fourth liners. Top six. Carter. Tierney. No one really there. Lowry. Sutter. I don't know. I think we got another guy back. We got to get back our guy back in Juju. So now how many players do we have on our team? It should be like 41, 42. 40. Simp to next season. I think we should be good. That should be all for now. We'll simp to next year. We'll get the lines edited. I'll show you. We start year two. That's going to be the end of that one. Peace. See you next time.